See? Okay. That's a matchup that, you know, Rico is going to understand reasonably well, but everybody has their own take on the character. Right. So we'll see what 104 does. I imagine for Bison, it's just a, it's a big footsie battle, you know, trying to space out with that medium kick and that roundhouse. Maybe some scissor kicks pressure if he gets the knockdown, but it's probably all about this right here. Playing out. Well, oh. that didn't last for too long. <laughs> okay, gets the throw. Oh, oh wow. Stand short, immediately stand short from Rico Suave into Tornado for a reset. Ooh, too far. Could have punished otherwise. Mm -hmm. Yeah, right into the knockdown. Ooh! Rico had the right idea. But now let's see if 104 can get the pressure going. Okay, this is the chance. No, he crosses up, but damage at least. Looks like Rico far away. Oh, oh! He had he had an idea. Right. Uh, looks like input error maybe from uh, 104. Yeah, I would think so. Oh, he catches him with a full screen EX Psycho Crusher. Oh, he again. And now, question is, how does Rico make this life deficit? 20 seconds to do it, and he only needs a couple of hits. Looks like he's he's hoping that Rick 104 is gonna make that mistake of Psycho Crushing it, right? Already it already worked once. I don't know about the second time. Oh, oh and it chip, does. Chip. Rick 104 takes the first round over Rico Suave. Pick up the pace. Fight. Alright, some light pressure right there. Nice. Okay. Step kick. Gets stuff going for himself. Rico Suave, a lot of meter. Okay. okay, blows up the focus. Cancels into this as a kick. Okay, gets the throw. Has him in the corner. Oh, I'm not sure I like that. Yeah, if you're right next to the corner, then he recovers pretty quickly. But that wasn't right next right. to the corner. And this is really more the kind of play that I, I think of Rico. With. You know, there's a lot of just staying away, waiting for the opponent to put himself into a bad oh, spot. Oh, and again, the stand fierce FADC into tornado throw. Yeah, you saw him just right. hanging out there. He saw that there was no meter on Rick 104's side to get that Fight EX uh, doubles reverse mm -hmm. for the EX punch aspect of it. So why not just hold focus? Uh -huh. Rico gets the focus. He was going to go in here. Normal throw. Okay. Rick uses his, his only bar, but he's almost close to another one to get out of there. And just like that, it's dangerous territory. Yeah, one more mix-up really from Abel's potential to close it. Rico just waiting. <laughs> uh, Rick jumped too far back to get the punish on that whiff EX tornado throw. Okay, Rick being a little bit more active there. Well, backs off afterward though. Slowly backing Rico into the corner. Oh, oh Rico! Double dash into tornado throw. Can he use his last bar to get out of there? Can't get hit. No! Oh, nice anti-air from Rico Suave. Yeah, great spacing for himself right there. That was game one. Good game. You know, both players did, both players did a lot of good stuff. Rick definitely looks like he's capable. Mm -hmm. Sure. I'm taking this. Okay, yeah, here's Rick now in the corner. No meter for, for Abel, which means that Bison can really pressure here. Safely done. Oh, that might have lost pressure for himself. Yeah, kind of did a little bit. Oh, yes, it did. Now he's in the corner. Okay, we're right back in. Oh, he yeah, stays that's in what he wanted right. before. He was just too far away to make it work. Alright, Rico Suave gets the neutral jump, punish into the tornado throw. 
Okay, this is gonna be Ultra. And Rico, Probably gonna be around. Yeah. Rico Suave now on match point against Rick 104. Yeah, he's already up 1 to 0. Oh, okay. So, totally different start right now from Rico. After four rounds of, uh, you know, very stay away play until he got the chance, goes in at the start. I really like that change. It would be hard to deal with fast changes of pace like that. Oh, nice read! All right, and Rick trying to just keep him in the corner. Yeah, trying to, he's trying to pressure safely, you know, he's trying to find ways. Well, might have wanted EX on that. Okay, he okay. does this time. Nice block. Uh, nice block from Rico. Good understanding. Rick has life lead, so. But he goes in anyways. Oh, I don't see. And just like that, that might have costed him. You know, Rick had to consider. Oh! Oh! Oh, Rico, no! Oh, no. And Rico goes for the tornado throw. Now, I think if he would have just comboed, he would have killed him. I think you're right. So, you know, a few mistakes from both players in that last series of events. But Rick 104 definitely on the receiving end of that one. He now has a chance to stay in this. Okay, no, he has him in the corner. Yeah, a lot of this game has been spent in the corner. Mm -hmm. And yet, you know, Rico won one round, had a chance to win a second. Okay, Rick 104 definitely in control this round. Okay, but that could all change. Oh, oh yeah, nice. that's how it starts. Oh, yeah. oh, nice throw. Good read, but he doesn't get anything out of it. And so back to a pretty even situation right now. Not too far. Oh, nice stand medium kick. Okay, guess this is a kick, Rick. Playing in the range that he needs to play in order to make this a difficult task for Abel, but he definitely has to be careful of EX change of direction. Because that would put Rick Oh, guess the slide trade. Yeah, with two bars, you know, Rico has a lot of damage output available to him. A lot right. of mix-ups. You can see Rico's just waiting. Oh, oh he found he it! He gets the hit. Oh. Now, I'm not sure if it's going to kill. Yeah, I don't know. It'll All be right. close. Yeah, I don't think it's going to kill. So oh, they already think it is. They're already standing up. No! It's not death. Yeah, Rico's got to sit down. Rico's got to sit down. Oh! oh! He thought it was over. He thought it was over. That was a, that, that was a longer combo. And Rico Suave. I don't know why this always happens at this tournament. I don't know if you guys remember, two years ago, Wolf Cone stood up against Ricky Ortiz because he thought he won and he didn't, and Ricky Ortiz ended up coming back and winning because of that. I don't know why this happens at I this time. <laughs> but in true Chicago tradition, Rico Suave stands up too early. No, that's, that's really unfortunate for him because <laughs> both of those rounds he lost in that game, mm -hmm. no, those might have been his fault. Yep. But he's a tournament vet and a threat in a lot of games, a lot of experience, so I don't think that's going to affect him mentally too much. Right. Which one of these fighters will snatch victory from the jaws of defeat? Oh, oh wow. wow. Just neutral jump, and then when they both land, gets a tornado throw. And this has turned into a very patient game. Oh, gets the step kick. Rico Suave. Good damage for himself. Oh, the oh. mix-up. And that does kill Rico Suave. Now on match point. Still shaking his head <laughs> from the last game. Now Rico has those two bars. He goes in right after. Oh! Saw that from Onisan, but different, different variation of it. Yeah, there's that EX bar to spend just in case. Oh, and he wakes up with the EX tornado throw. That's the first time he's done that yeah. this whole set. Saved it for what he hopes is going to be the last round. We'll see what Rick has to say about that, though. 
Oh, maybe nothing. And here comes Rico. No. And Rico backs off. How's Rick going to get this damage? Okay. And Mortality Sports, Rico Suave takes it over Rick 104. Well, you know, that was, that was a really nice save from Rico. Cause yeah. That previous game did not need to go how it went. <laughs> Absolutely did not. That was extremely in Rico's favor. But he stood up a little too soon. And we have another moment here in Chicago for Combo Breaker 2015. Okay, so we're going to throw it to a quick series of uh, videos that we have prepared for you. We'll be back in just a sec.